Mikel, what was the biggest difference in that fourth quarter that allowed you guys to close out this game and find a way? Um, I think defense against stops. Um, you know, everybody stepped up really well. That subbed in, and then you know Dennis just led us at the end and was scoring and dishing. So uh, you know, just very good team win. How do you? What can you take from this game in a game where sometimes when shots were falling, but you guys were able to still stay together and be resilient? Yeah, I mean it's going to be times like that. Um, but yeah, it's just you know just play all 48. You know it's going to be tough, and you know not giving up, not quitting. And um, that's what we did. Just you know learn how to win even when you play bad. Trending was obviously huge for you guys. So was Jalen and Noah. Mm -hmm. um, with Trending just coming in, how big was it for him just to be able to step in with the cams out and? June out as well. It's great. I mean, he's always ready. You know, we got a lot of depth on this team, and um, you know, he's always ready, waiting for his moment. And um, you know, did a great job. He's going to continue to keep being really good, and we will need him again when we go to Washington. And then with Clowney and Wilson sharing the minutes in crunch time, just how big is it for their development that they were not just on the court but contributing in a tight game like this? Yeah, great. I mean, it's just they learn on the fly. Um, I think they're you know really good like rookies that just kind of learn and. Get everything like a sponge and, um, and go out there and play hard. So, you know, they did a great job tonight. Mikael, when you, sorry. Mikael, when you uh, went with Team USA to the Philippines last summer for the FIBA World Cup, what was the best part about being in the Philippines? Um, I think probably the love we got from the fans and everybody. I think everybody was really cool. You could tell they really loved basketball. Um, but yeah, it was outside in a hotel and, you know, the games, you could see how loud they were. So, I'll probably say the fans. Have you thought about joining? Team USA again this summer just to kind of redeem yourself? Yeah, I mean, you know, that's that's in the future right now. Not you see whatever that happens, but just pretty much locked in right now here. What was your reaction? Noah Clowney hitting the three. Kevin Ollie spoke about how that's been in his game and, and then Noah also said that it's only a matter of time he's gonna knock down some more. I mean, yeah, I'm, I was kinda confused why they was playing off him. Um <laughs> I tell him not he's not no five man, but I guess he gotta play five at times, but he's really a wing to me, so um but yeah, I mean yeah, I was kind of actually surprised. It was even open like a couple of times. I was like, all right, we're going to, you know, I know he can shoot, so he's going to keep passing to him. What type of versatility does that bring to you guys with the guy that can play the four or the five? Yeah, I mean, he just brings a lot of depth and put him anywhere. And uh, like I said, he's got a lot of options, you know, a lot of people on the bench, you know, ready to play. And, uh, you know, it's just, you can put people anywhere. You took that awkward fall, and we all got kind of a little nervous there, but you were able to once again just will your way yeah. still and play that game. Just what were you feeling in that moment, and just were you ever concerned? Uh, yeah, it just rolled the, the hell out of my ankle a little bit. Um, but I think God blessed me with some, I know I'm skinny, but blessed me with some strong ankle bones. And, you know, even though it was hurting, I just, you know, just kind of go through a little mindset and just, just go up and down, you know. I was, you know, my high school coach always taught me, you know, wherever your ankle you know, he just tell him just go tie your shoe tighter. So, he's, <laughs> so that's what I kind of did, and uh, it just kept rolling. Kale said you didn't want him to take, uh, come out. Did you tell him that just to make sure he stayed in? In the fourth, no. I just, I know I was, I was playing bad pretty much the whole game. Um, but I just wanted to win, and I felt you know good enough for him. Like, you know, I think I could you know help the team win right now. And I just, I just didn't want to lose this game. You know, no matter what the outcome was. But I was amped. Just told him I played the whole fourth, and he was like. Pretty much was that was going to happen anyway, so appreciate him. Mikal, Mikal, oh, sorry. What's your secret for being so durable? Like you know, you don't get injured a lot. Fingers crossed. Um, I got no, I, I don't know. I got no secret, man. I think I just take care of my body. You know, like I said, God, my parents. You know, they, my bones is pretty blessed and they heal pretty quick. But um, I don't know, man. Just everything I do, recovery and you know the lifts and everything, just just help prevent it. You know, and um. Just, you know, saying, staying blessed as well. Mikhail, with the March Madness going on, we know you are a huge supporter of women basketball. And this year, we've been seeing some outstanding talent. Is there a team or a player that you're looking in the women's side of the uh, March Madness this year? And can you have a word about that? Yeah. Um, who did I just watch? I just watched LSU. Um, I, mean, I, just love, I just love how fire they are, you know. And it's, you can see on the internet where, you know, they're starting to, like, dislike some players. Like, I think Angel's one of them where they're starting to dislike her. But it's like, it's good. That means people are really watching and understanding. And, you know, now you see the emotions they play with and they get all fired up. They get texts, doing all these gestures, same things that we all do. And it's, it's great to see it like that. And that means everybody, you know, when you start getting hate from people, that means people are locked in. So, you know, it's good to have that love.